3,000 protesters gathered at the State Library in Melbourne today in a rally for marriage equality. This is a fantastic turnout. How many of you are here for the first time? Show your hands. Oh, well done. How many of you are repeat offenders and are coming back? Monday From over a quarter of a million responses around the country, 64% of people wanted marriage equality. I mean, this campaign is just going from strength to strength. and. The pressure is building up to the point where the dam wall is, I think, um, about to burst. And every religious leader that continues to support this inequality have blood on their hands. So we're out here today to send a message that we're opposing these laws and we want them to change the marriage. I'm wrong. I mean, if you told me that I would be spending my time arguing and lobbying for the right to get married, I would have fallen on the floor laughing. I wrote a series of songs about, you know, current gay right issues. Equal down, equal dive, your man in the rally finished with a contest for the best placard. 3,000 marchers worked through the CBD with each section chanting for equal rights and waving placards. Nurses unions, tertiary unions, Political groups such as the Greens and Socialists were among those visible in the march. The march is in its eighth year, and it's especially important this year as there are three bills before Parliament, one put forth by Sarah Hansen Young in the Senate, and Adam Bant has put forth a similar bill in the House. After winding through the CBD, protesters ended up in front of the Treasury House for a mass illegal wedding ceremony. Couples who intended to get married were asked to step forward. I'm a real priest. We have before us real couples. Marriage is the union of two people to the exclusion of all others, voluntary ending to for life. Do you take this chosen person as your life partner? So how it holds from this day forward, marriage, as long as you both shall live. At the completion of the ceremony, certificates were handed out and the best dressed couple was asked to step forward. Squirrel May, Green Left News.